Dear friends, in this video I am going to tell you about the wild boars of Western Ghats. The Indian boar differs from the Central European boar by its large mane, which runs in the crest along its back from its head to lower body, larger, more sharply featured and straighter skull. its smaller small sharper ears and over overall lighter build it is slightly taller and more sparsely haired than the european form though its back bristles are much more developed the tail is also more tufted and the cheeks hairier Adults measure from 84 to 91 cm in shoulder height with one specimen in West Bengal having reached 97 cm and 152 cm in body length. Weight ranges from 91 to 136 kg. The animal has interacted with the humans in the Indian subcontinent since the Upper Paleolithic with the oldest depiction being a cave painting at Bimbatka rock shelters and it occasionally appears in Hindu mythologies a story present in the Brahmana says that the Indra killing an evil doer doer who has stolen the treasure of asuras then giving its carcass to vishnu who offers at uh, offers it as a sacrifice to the gods and goddesses and they eat it in a story in charagaham samhita a boar named yermusha is avatar of brahma and he raises the earth and sky from the primeval waters of the universe during the creation of the creation that creates the universe in the ramayana mahabharata and the puranas another boar varaha is an avatar of vishnu that kills hiranyaksha and saves bhumi while boars are known for their destructive nature to crops making them a threat to agriculture The boars are active during the morning and evening and they also feed at night. They are considered one of the most courageous wild animals and often engage in territorial fights even with the predators like tigers. The Indian wild boar population faces several conservation challenges and efforts are being made to protect the native species. in its diverse environment the indian wild boar also known as sus scrofa cristatus is a subspecies of the wild boar it possesses distinct physical characteristics such as differentiate it from its european counterpart these var- uh, variations include large main running from the its black larger and more sharply featured skull smaller ears and a lighter build the adult indian wild boar can reach a shoulder height of 83.8 to 91.4 cm they boast a powerful and muscular physique enabling them to thrive in the diverse habitats Their coarse hair ranges in color from brown to black, providing effective camouflage to their surroundings. Indian wild boars display adaptability and resilience, making them well suited for various habitats, including dense forests, grasslands, scrublands, and even agricultural areas. These remarkable creatures inhabit the Indian subcontinent and can be found across the different altitudes 
ranging from the sea level to the higher mountain regions, illustrating their ability to adapt to a wide range of environmental conditions. To further enhance your understanding of the Indian wild boar, physical characteristics and habitat, the table is there. Indian wild boars are social animals that live in groups is called sounders. These sounders typically consist of the adult females and their offspring. While adult males known as boars tend to solitary and establish their own territories. Breeding occurs throughout the year with big mating seasons varying across the different regions. The gestation period lasts for around four months after which the female gives birth to the little piglets. The social structure of the breeding habits of the wild boars contribute to their population, dynamics and overall survival as species. The Indian wild boar, also known as the Scrofata cristatus, plays a crucial role in the maintaining the balance of the ecosystems in India. These majestic creatures are the efficient seed dispersers, aiding in the propagation of the plant species by consuming fruits and vegetation. Through the process of the digestion, undigested seeds are dispersed through their droppings, allowing for the growth of new plants and contributing to the biodiversity of their habitat. Furthermore, the Indian wild boar serves the essential prey species, providing subsistence to the predators and contributing to the intricate 